Quinnipiac men's ice hockey team lost a tough one to number five Clarkson today here at the People's United Center due largely in fact to their slow start out of the gate. Well, let's take a trip to the film room so I can show you how. Now kind of an unfortunate one here to start the game for the Bobcats is they didn't know this one went in and they had to reset the clock after about two minutes of play. But let's take a look at it. So Clarkson's coming in with a three on two into the zone here. Quinnipiac's got a couple back checkers back. We got Metza and Deliberatory back on D. And we got a good stick on puck here from Metza, but 13 here on Clarkson makes a nice move, puts it through his stick there, gets it towards the middle. Now watch this play here from 27 on Clarkson, right? He's going to get his stick right there in front of Deliberatory's stick. He's going to pop this puck up and eventually get around him right here. Now Deliberatory stops skating here, you know? That's a big thing on this play. He stops skating. 27 gets by him, gets his first shot on it, and then we got just got chaos in front, right? We got a mad scramble. Petroselli not sure where the puck is. Lay takes his man away from the net here, doesn't stop on the goal line. And right there, you can see it right here, eight knocks his puck in, it's completely over the goal line. Now this would be the first of two goals that the Bobcats let up in the early minutes that they would never be able to fully recover from. But thankfully they have a chance for a quick turnaround tomorrow night for St. Lawrence at the People's United Center. For Q30 Sports, I'm Patrick Flatley.